which included a first place in the grip skill, so that should come really in handy on the challenge course. But she was second in dash also, so very well-rounded athlete. And that's what we're yes, looking for in a strongest ninja. That speed will definitely benefit her here. And that power. Look at that swing. She went straight for that bar. Not even bothering to go for the incline. She just decided to skip on through. With a 45-second time limit, these courses cannot be very forgiving with careless mistakes. And that is something that Gabrielle is completely avoiding right now. Making this look easy. Showing why she was first in the power rankings for the kids female. Also made it to stage three at the world championship. Such a prolific resume at a young age. Unable to complete driver's ed, but that should put her in first place. As we take a replay here. That great technique at the end of the Lachey line. And she's in first. By a solid comfortable 10 seconds gabrielle lakata number one in the power rankings i believe number one in points as well number one in strongest ninja she was first in the grip skill and second in dash at worlds fourth in power also so i mean a young woman that has a championship mindset she's going to have a lot more medals in her future if she sticks with this sport and we hope she does is that going to begin with a Premier Series gold medal today? Only time will tell. You can see a very quick time to the skyhooks and not wasting any breath as she just jumps right into it. But that's the Point right idea. Up. Yep. You Even if you fail this obstacle, you're going to get a chance to breathe. And this time limit is tight. You know that you're going to have to go far into this course if you want to guarantee a spot. Because beating Skyhooks alone is not good enough. Although she, she has just made that jump hook. a picture-perfect arc. If she dismounts, I believe this is the fastest to the Kaleidoscope, which would put her in the finals. Well, beating this would guarantee her spot, and she isn't thinking about anything other than that buzzer. Absolutely. And we see much more centered grab, and throws it nice it spins out but she catches it anyways and there we go she's officially guaranteed her spot in the finals we will see gabrielle join ariana and elise in fact i believe that puts her into first place but she would love to beat boats on top of that has enough time to get to the last obstacle 23 seconds a little more than that I she's believe. taken after the boys and going right for that dismount and lands it. That is precisely what she does. Spills over, but she's going to have a chance to beat Area 53. You know, Nobody has beaten this obstacle school yet. And we see the lights start to flash. Less than 10 seconds remaining. She's going for it. Does not, not get able it. To get up that trapeze. I think time ran out anyway. But one more look. Beating the skyhooks. Picture perfect. Also knocking Landing down kaleidoscope. kaleidoscope and moving into first place. Incredible. There's that dismount from the boats that really, really locked her into first there. Once again, you can see her at the top of the leaderboard.